And so we can draw a Venn diagram to help us out here. We have set X. No of members is nine. And we have an intersection of set X and Y. So I'm gonna draw another set, which is set Y intersecting set X. And we're told that four members are in the intersection, which is right here. It's in the middle where they both set intersect. So this symbol here means intersect. Okay, next we're told in the union of both sets we have 15 members. So the only places we're going to put information is right here, right? Whatever number that is, we're going to add it to 4, add it to this number, and we get 15. And then let's, say, let's assume that we call this section here A. Where 4 is, we call that B. And where the next question mark, we call that C. Right, when I add A, plus B plus C, I should get 15 because I'm adding up the three section, the union in other words, of A, X and Y. Okay, so now let me just take this out. So how do I find the number of elements represented here by A? Well, A plus four should give me nine because the two sections are within the circle of X. So to find that, I'll need to say nine minus four, right? And that gives me five. Let's see if it makes sense. Five plus four is nine. Okay, now when I add five plus four, I get nine. Plus C should give me 15. So nine plus what gives me 15? So it's 15, let's take nine from it. Remember the total should be 15. We have nine so far. So the difference will be six. So six should be here, such that when we add six plus four plus five, I get 15. That means we can clearly see that within the circle of Y, we have six plus four, which is 10. So the number of elements in Y is equal to 10. Another way to do this is using the formula, by the way, that the number of elements in X union Y is equal to the number of elements in X plus the number of elements in set Y minus the number of elements in X intersect Y. Now I could explain why I might do that. The number of elements in the union we're told, so let's look at the question without the drawing. We're told that the number of, number of elements in the union is 15, so we can write 15 there. But let's see if it makes sense. The number of elements in X is nine. We're told that. If you look at the drawing, we can clearly see it's 5 plus 4, which is 9. Now, of elements in Y, we don't know. Minus the intersection, which we are told as well, which is 4. So that's the equation that works. All right? So we have 15 equals 9 minus 4 plus number of elements in Y. I just basically shift around the numbers, the terms. So we can have a minus 4 close to 9. So this is 15 equals 5 plus number of elements in Y. Now, I want to find out what the number of elements in Y is. Obviously, 15 is equal to what? 5 plus what? 10. So the number of elements in Y must be 10. Or we can subtract 5 from both sides. That would work out just the same. Number of elements in Y is equal to 10.